gotta get up You gotta push yourself just a little bit further when you think Friday night at the Unidome in Cedar Falls, our second Class 4A Iowa High School football semifinal between the hometown Cedar Falls Tigers and the 16 seed in the 16 team bracket. Got all the way to the Unidome, the Southeast Polk Rams. Take a look at how it happened. First quarter, Southeast Polk gets on the board first. Gavin Williams, four yard touchdown run. Extra point no good, six nothing Rams after one. Second quarter, Cedar Falls. The big pass play, Kale Losher to Ben Cernet for 37 yards into Southeast Polk territory for the first time. Leads to their first points of the game, Matthew Cook, 32 yard field goal to cut the lead in half at 6-3. Final minute of the second quarter, third and six at the Southeast Polk 16 yard line. Cedar falls on offense. Losher finds his number one target, Logan Wolf, 16 yard touchdown, 10-6 Cedar falls at the half. Third quarter, Southeast Polk at the goal line. The quarterback sneak for Josiah Cole gets the touchdown. The extra point blocked again. It's 12-10 in the third quarter. Cedar Falls takes over from there. The long ball down the left side. Losher to Wolf again. 63 yards to the house. Cedar's ahead for good. 17-12 after three. Early in the fourth quarter, another field goal. Matthew Cook, absolute money. He's got the rocket leg. 20 to 12, Cedar falls ahead. Cedar falls third and nine at the 35 yard line, trying to put this game on ice. Losher makes it happen. Third down conversion comes through. They get all the way to the goal line, looking to get this game on ice. Losher up the middle, makes it a two possession game. 26 to 12, Cedar falls. Last push for Southeast Pole. Fourth down and 10. But Cedar Falls comes up big. Great tackle to end this one for the Tigers in their hometown. Their undefeated season continues. Cedar Falls 12-0 into the Class 4A state championship game. Friday night, November the 16th, 7 p.m. here at the Unidome against the five-time defending champion Dowling Catholic Maroons. Hometown team against the five-time champs. Let's fill the Unidome next Friday night.